Good question. Oh, I was about to say, Ginger, where'd you put the iPad, girl? So you can be able to see the sisters. I'll wait for y'all to come on in. And then we shall begin. Would have been smart if I had an extension cord, right, sisters? Right? Yeah, I know. Welcome, girlfriends. Come on in. Make sure y'all share this video. We're live, honey. Look, you know what I'm going to try to do? I'm going to try to make sure I try to get come live every Friday. Like, Friday is more so like my chill day and stuff like that. So, um, I'm going to try to make sure I come on live every Friday. That, we're going to work that out. Fridays and Mondays are the my days to get on live. Even might be on a Saturday, too. I don't know. But we might even do that, too. Oh, if I could find me an extension cord, it would be on right about now. In the meantime, as y'all come on in, please make sure that you like this video. Please make sure you share this video. And make sure you subscribe if you have not. And please make sure your notifications are on so that you don't miss me again. Well, welcome everybody. If you don't know who I am, this is your first time. My name is Jazzy Jujube. I'm a multifunctional, contemporary, everyday mompreneur. I'm the CEO and founder of JashayEssentials.com, where I create and make all natural skincare and haircare products for your everyday needs. I'm a licensed cosmetologist and also a licensed educator, also an MUA and also a licensed electrician. And I'm a motivator. And I'm here to motivate you to be authentically, unapologetically you. So welcome, sisters! So... Look, order first order of business is for you to come on in. Before you greet me, please make sure you greet the family first. Just come on in and say, hey, sisters. And then you can say hi to me because, you know, I come last. You know, I always put, I put you guys first. So just make sure we do that first. Let's make sure we say hi to the family. Come on in, sisters. Hey, sisters. Happy Friday. Girlfriends. So I'm going out tonight, girls. Juju is going out tonight, girlfriends, honey. Hold on, so I want to make sure I see everybody's comments because I don't want to miss nobody's comments and stuff. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's go to YouTube. Let's go to YouTube so we can find these comments. Let's go to YouTube. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Um, and also, if you, um, I, I, I know I get a, um, uh, comments too, like, hey, Juju, where can I find you outside of YouTube? My name is Jazzy Juju B on all of my platforms. You can find me on Facebook and you can also find me on IG. So please go to um, IG under Jazzy Juju B82 and find me there. Where's YouTube? There's YouTube. Okay. You know how like the grandma be doing? Look, 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 look. What are you? No, I'm not making a wig. I'm just styling one of my wigs and I'm gonna bring that. Out. I just washed her and everything. I put the um, uh, I use the my I use the um turmeric soap and I also use my peppermint shampoo and then. <clears throat> And then I used my smoothie treatment and then I left that on for about a good maybe 25 minutes and then rinsed it off. And now we are uh, about to blow dry her. Okay, so, um, and I said, well, you know what? Let me come on. I, I think y'all would enjoy this, right? Y'all don't see the like button either? I don't, I don't know. How, how, does anybody know how, how all this can see the like button? I don't know how to do it. Guys, y'all know I'm like new to this too. So, okay, because I'm here. I'm here, right? You know what I'm going to try to do? Let me try to sign in on my other channel, right? If I try to do that and see if there's a way. Let me see. That's it. Let's see. It's live messages. No, that doesn't what it says. I'm not sure how to do it, but I'm sure somebody in here might know. Hi, Gwendolyn. Hey, Sharon. Hey, Sylvia. Hey, Robert. Hey, Adam. Hey, Zamora. Did I say it right? Hi, Michelle. Hi, Tashina. Hi, Karen. Hey, honey. Hi, sisters. Hey, girlfriends. Hey, girlfriends. Hi. I just want to make sure I can see your comments. So I'm going to put my iPad right there, girl. Hey, Miss Riley. Hey, sweetheart. So I want to make sure I can. Yeah, look. That's right there so I can see. Carol. Hey, boo. Hey, honey. Look, I'm going to repeat myself. Don't be laughing, sisters. Don't be laughing. What's wrong, Lulu? Let me bring down the volume. Okay, good. We muted that. Hey, Alicia. Hey, boo. Okay. I'll go on your surgery video. You gave me life. I love your energy and your bluntness. Keep it up. Let's trust this. Thank you, my love. See, because you know what I'll be telling everybody, right? Look, I ain't for everybody, but I'm for somebody. I'm too raw for a lot of people because they were like, you just so, you don't be caring. No, guys, I come on like this. I come on like this. I slap a wig on and be slayed, girl. And, and, and I'm going to say this to say that 
You got to be comfortable in your own skin. Most people are moved by what everybody else thinks of them and how everybody views them. I'm not that type of person. You know, like I don't give a, I don't care. I'm so comfortable in my skin. I know who I am. I know where I'm at. I know where I'm going. Do you hear me? I know what the Lord got for me. So therefore, other people's opinions mean nothing. You hear? And I'm just saying that to say it ain't being cocky. Is I'm convinced. Not cocky, honey. I ain't cocky. I ain't conceited. I'm convinced, baby. That's what you tell them, honey. Words from Juju, honey. I ain't cocky, baby. I ain't conceited, baby. I'm convinced. All right? You got to be comfortable in your own skin. Stop worrying about what other people think and how other people view you. Because at the end of the day, regardless of their view, good or bad, they're going to have an opinion anyway. You get what I'm saying? Everybody has an opinion. And it's either if you care or you don't. Like, I don't care about other people's opinion. Don't care how they feel, what they think. Because at the end of the day, here, here, in this here, Juju Jazzy Land, honey, I pay these bills. Them two kids that I got, I take care of them. Nobody don't take care of me. I take care of myself. Nobody pays my bills. I pay my own bills. So who I look like worrying about somebody else's opinion of me when they don't take care of nothing over here? You, do you hear me? So with that being said, I'm saying that to a sister here or a brother here who is more concerned about how other people view them or deem them, let it go. We're going to take our tea pens because what we're going to do now, sisters, we're prepping our wig to blow dry her. So I got to get her down on my little mannequin head. This mannequin head is mad old, sisters. Mad old. But we're going to tack her down. And I'm going to go where this comb is at so I can make sure that it does it. Okay, do y'all see that? Let me open this up so y'all can see. Notice that the wig has a comb, a wig comb in there. So where that tab is at, I put it there so I don't have to put it in the in the lace. Because you don't want to be poking holes in the lace and damage the lace. Make sense, guys? We got that? We got that? All right. So now we're going to go to the other side. And we're going to grab another T-pen. If you don't know what a T-pen looks like, this is a T-pen right here. Okay? Here's a T-pen right here. We're going to open up that flap. So I'm going to let you see the T-pen. You see that right here? Okay? So instead of putting it on the lace, you're going to put it on the comb. So turn it, flip it back like this. Grab this like so. You see how I'm putting pressure on it? Booyah. Keep it in place. Okay. Okay. In order to like, you must click the X. Like like it, then click the live button to come back to the live. Oh, in order to like, you must click the X. Like, then click the live. Oh, okay. In order, for you, in order to like, you must click the X. Like it, then click the the live button to come back into the live. Sylvia, thank you, honey. Dashini, you said your surgery is good luck, sweetheart. Be calm and, and, and you pray. You hear me, boo? Be calm and you pray. All right? All right, so we're trying to pin that in. There we goes. Oh, guys, y'all got it. Yay! Sisters, thank you for liking the video. I'm trying to make sure my background looks cute. You know, I'm a little stuck up when it comes to the stuff like that, you know? I will be all professional and put on my cape, which I don't know where it is right now. Um, uh, it's really not that serious. It's, it'll be all right. I, the only issue that I'm having right now is that I don't know where my extension cord is, but uh, let me see. Maybe maybe my little bag might have something because I need an extension cord so that I can blow dry a wig. So, guys, I've got my little bag with all my tools and stuff, comb, sprays, favorite sprays that I like and everything like that in there. Um... We got to go downstairs, sisters. Hold on. We got to go downstairs. We got to go get an extension cord. I wish I knew where one right was uh, off top my head was, but I don't know. I know where one is downstairs, so I have to go downstairs. Just wish I had it downstairs. Upstairs. Yo, why my neighbor, Mr. Thompson, cut my grass for me today? So, so let me tell what happened, right? So, I come outside and I see Mr. Thompson, you know, on his lawnmower. And I say, hey, Mr. Thompson, do you mind um, cutting my grass for me right here, please? Because these dandelions are growing back, you know? And he's like, which one, you, what, where do you want me to do and stuff like that? And I said, well, cut all around my yard or whatever, you know? So some guy that was with him, I guess, or whatever that was bought on his property, cut his, helping him cut his grass. He walks over, he says, so you want this? And I said, hold on. I said, who are you? I said, who are you? Oh, he said, oh, I'm with Miss Smith. I said, but I said, so I asked you, who are you? You're on my property. Did I, was I talking to you? Did I ask you to walk over here? Him and Thompson, oh, that's my nephew. I said, Mrs. Thompson, him being your nephew has nothing to do with you. I didn't ask him a question. I wasn't talking to him. I was talking to you. 
Now, some people are like, oh, Jew, you rude. No, I never, I never spoke to this man. Why are you on my property? I didn't ask you any questions. I asked Thompson to come over here. I didn't ask for you to come over here. Why are you? Oh, he took his, took his ass right across the street. Go continue to do what you was doing. Don't be trying to be slick. Because I didn't ask you to do anything. I, that's why I called Mr. Thompson over. Yeah, I'm petty. I told you I'm petty. Like, for real. Don't, don't play with me. I'm very protective of my territory. You get what I'm saying? I don't like people. I don't like people trying to get in my space. Stuff like that I don't like. Like, you don't know me from Adam. And you have the audacity to walk on my property. Like, oh, so you want this cut. You want, you oh, so you want this amount of cuts. Mr. Thompson, you better get him. Because Mr. Thompson already know how I am. He already know how I move. If you wasn't talking to you, don't, 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 don't do that. Don't even come property. Because I know Miss Thompson, he was like, oh my God, Jew, please don't blow up. Jew, please don't blow up. I said, I'm not going to blow up, but you know how I am about people coming into my space and you don't know me. Don't do that. Don't do that. And especially when, you know, you're a woman, you got your own stuff going on or whatever, and mofo see that and stuff, you know, people think like people will try to take your kindness for weakness and like, oh, she's friendly. She's nice. So I can, you know, walk over there. Hell no, you won't. I bet you won't walk up over here no more. Bet you won't do that again. He got an attitude too. I know he got an attitude. He felt a little embarrassed because I probably did I just just what do you call him? Dismas mask dismasculate him? Is that the word that's called? No, I didn't. You should have stayed in your place. You should have you should have you should stayed in your place. Because if you'd stayed in your place, you wouldn't have been embarrassed. Okay. All right. So I got my blow dryer plugged up. Blow dryer is done. Um, here's my beautiful wig. Guys, where did I get emasculated? Thank you, sis. Okay, emasculated. <laughs> so I emasculated him, right? Like, but I really didn't because you asked for it. You walked up over here and nobody asked you to be here. You don't know me. I've never seen you a day in my life. And you just walk up on my property like, 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 like it was okay. Nah, no, no partner. Uh-uh, you got the game confused. But in your way, sisters. Okay, so um, this wig that I got is an, I think it's Italian yakki wig this italian yaki wig came from uh, aprillacewigs.com anybody who knows my favorite company when it comes to me purchasing my i just bought like three more wigs right was it three i bought or was it two i think i bought two more wigs i think i think i bought two. yep i bought two so yeah i bought two more wigs and they're gonna be here i bought my best friend a wig and then i bought me two right so it's gonna be here on monday and I still got two more that I still haven't done nothing to, but we're going to do them together here. I'm probably going to do them live or I might do an edited video for them. I haven't decided yet, but we'll figure that out, right? So this is an Italian Yaki wig. Okay, so this is a lace front wig. It's cheaper if you buy a lace front wig. The only thing is that it doesn't have much parting space. So if you guys want to see the parting space, let me get a little measuring tape. Let me get a measuring tape so I can do it. I think it's maybe two inches. It might be only two inches of parting space, and I was tight. When I say I was so pissed when this wig came in the mail, and I bought a lace front, and I was like, what am I supposed to do with this parting space? But girl, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. When I said I made it work, when I said this is one of my most favorite wigs, I just wish that it had more um, parting space. So a lace front wig is not what I'm going to recommend to anybody. What I would recommend is a 360. Get yourself a 360 um, lace 360, right? 360 full lace, 360 lace wig, 360 wig. Yeah, a three, a full 360 wig or something like that. You, you know what I'm talking about, right? Get you that because you get at least four inches of parting space. Who's that? Oh, I thought that was in the mail. So I'm going to measure it real quick for you guys so y'all can see. But I really do love the wig. I just wish, like I said, I just wish I knew better, but I didn't. This wig is by April Lace Wigs. This wig is from April Lace Wigs. This is an Italian yakki, and I got 20 inches, and I ain't gonna say it again, okay? April Lace Wigs, Italian yakki, 20 inches. We got that so far? We got that, guys? All right, good. So I'm gonna um, measure this. So it's at, see, you want it to be at least four, four. Four gives you enough space. It's going to be from here, you know, because if you think about it, right? If you measure your head from all the way, from the tip all the way back here to the apex, right? Right? Look at that. Look at that. 
You want it to be at least four, you know, four. That gives you enough space, right, to do a middle part and everything, right? You see that? So that's why I recommend make sure you look before you just purchase a lace front wig and it doesn't have enough parting space and then you hot. You be like, oh my God, you know, because that's how I was. But y'all know I'm going to make it work anyway, right? So I made it work. So this is about, did I even finish measuring the thing? It's, this is about two and a half inches. That's it. That's the only space that's there. So I, I, I just feel, depending on the size of your head, not even, even if you have a small head, you still want at least four inches of lace, period, okay? So the next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to use one of my favorites, Holy Grails, honey. Holy Grails. Lot of body. It, has, it says, with coconut and shea oils, right? Wrap me foaming mousse. Creates soft wraps, defines curls, and tames frizz. And it's for all hair types, okay? So I'm going to put this in my wig. We're going to pump that up there, girl. We're going to pump that up there, girl. All right? We're going to put that all on her, okay? We're going to put that all up on her, okay? And you see the texture of it, guys? Like, yo, when I say I'm in love, I love hair that looks like mine, that I can make it emulate my hair, you know? Just saying, you know? Yes, and this is, it is, sis. This is like a 13 by 6, so it goes all the way around. It is a 13 by 6. Sorry, my bad. Yep, it is a 13 by 6. All right, so I make sure you get that underneath the bottom because, you know, usually the bot, the the, um, the nape area always get tangled up, you know, when it's sitting on your collar or whatever, it gets tangled up. So I'm going to put that there, right? There, we got that in there. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right. Next thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to grab this right here. This is called It's a 10 Miracle Leave-In Product. I love this. I've been using this for many, many years. I've probably, I've been using this for probably over um, 12, 13 years. This is one of my favorite products. Okay, this is a nice leave-in. I don't even need to do a lot at all, okay, to her. Boom, 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 boom. And then to help with some shine and also helps with frizz as well, you don't need a lot. We're going to apply my Jache hair growth oil, okay? Don't even need a lot. Look at this. One, two, three, four. You see that? That's it. You don't even need a lot because you don't want it to weigh down the hair. Okay, you don't want it to weigh down the hair. All right. Now we are ready to blow dry. Okay. Sac passe, Emmy. Hey, sweetheart. Now let's get this blow drying started. This wig actually does get big, I think. I think it does. I think it does get big. But we'll see. I'm not sure. We'll see, honey. Y'all can still hear me? And I tell you, I love this hair so much. Y'all wait till I'm done with it. Y'all be like, oh my God, dude. And I'm like, yep, girl. Yes, honey. This is the business. You have a party space and it's all lace in the back. Not lace, I mean, um, tracks in the back. That's okay. No big, especially like if you're on a budget. When I was, at the time, I was on a budget, and that's all I could afford at the time. So, you know, it is what it is. Can I tell you how much I pay for? I can't tell you off top. Um, I'm always buying wigs on that website because I trust them. I won't go really anywhere else like that. Only because I'd be scared that I might not get what I want, and I'm going to be pissed off. But them, I know I can trust them. I've been buying from them since 2000, what? Mm, 2012? It's been like six years, right? So 2013, yep, I've been buying from them since 2013. That's how long. I've got many of their wigs. And it is the business. You know what? I'm impatient. I ain't got time. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't got time, okay? I ain't got time for this right now. Right now. Okay. How about this? How about, how about this? How about that? Yup, we're gonna make this easier for us, honey. <laughs> you see, Nicole, girl, when I tell you, I, the texture looks like it mimics our hair. When I say it mimics our hair so well, when I put this joker on my head, you're gonna be like, yo, Juju. I'm like, I told you, sisters, I wasn't lying. I was not lying. And it gets nice and big. Take that flaunt iron, honey, and pass that flaunt iron on this wig, girl. Child, honey, they ain't ready. They ain't ready. They ain't ready. 
this is almost kind of like my workout as well too you know <laughs> thank you for everybody who's liked the video we got 35 in here sisters like this video if you haven't liked it yet the more y'all like the video the more my videos can get seen on youtube honey okay believe that The more you like, the more I come on live. The more you like, the more you share, the more I come on live. Because I go live on Facebook, but I'll definitely come live on YouTube. Because I'm like, y'all like my live. Y'all gonna laugh, right? Look. I mean, I don't know. Go to www.aprillacewigs.com to check out the prices, boo. Okay? Um, when I buy stuff, I don't, I, I really look, I don't, I couldn't tell you. I know I, it wasn't a lot of money. And like I said, it all depends on what your lot might be. Um, I could have probably paid like 200 to 25 maybe or less. Maybe. I'm not sure. I can't tell you because I've had this wig a while. Um, look what I did. Look how ghetto I am. Look what this is. You know what this is, right? This is a poise pad. I had to put the poise pad here so that I can knock this dummy on his head so I can keep it still so it doesn't move, right? Girl, you do. You got to do what you got to do. You got to do what you got to do. <laughs> do you see this? Oh my, and, and the wig is jet black. It's a jet black wig, sister. I was tight. I was like, why do I have a jet black wig? Huh? That was the best thing I could have ever did. Usually, like, when I know I'm going to put this on my head and keep it down, I'll use, like, black gel so I can keep it down so that it can mimic. Because if I use black, it'll turn my hair black in the front. I believe I was literally was about to sit there and comb through this with this girl my. So how's everybody doing? What y'all up to? What y'all got going on today? Friday, boo. You gotta work till five? You ain't got long to go, boo. You ain't got long to go at all. You see how fast it drives too? New movie that turned to kid. That's the name? What? The, the, turn to kid? I don't watch TV, so I don't even know what new movies is out or nothing. But today, um, it's my girlfriend's birthday, and we're going to go celebrate her birthday. We're going to a winery tonight. Yeah, you see how light it is? Kid, you want to go? Oh, man. What time you get off, boo? I got this up there when I can put this right here because it's hurting my eyes looking up like that. Oh, six o'clock? Uh, what time you get off? Because I'm like, what's the time you get on and then what time you leave? Look how, look at it, look at it. And this is just what, look, look, hold on. Look at that. And mind you, not even flat ironed it yet. Thanks for liking the video, sister. Thank you. Thanks for sharing. Let me put on my slippers. My feet hurt. Oh, wow. Okay. 
Can your hair help with your alopecia? It all depends. It all depends. Michelle, is your, um, are your follicles dead? If your follicles are still intact, then you're fine. If not, I can't help. Oh, with Regina Hall. Oh, I don't know. I don't watch TV, so I don't know. I'll go look. I'll definitely go look, sis. I'll go look. So now once I'm finished blow drying, right, I'm going to comb through the hair. Now it's still a little damp. Is it at the bottom? At the bottom. Just a little bit. What's on my brush? What's this on my brush? What's that? Okay. What's that? Okay. So I comb it out real good, right? Check it out, gauge it and everything like that. See what I'm working with, see what I'm working with, right? And I want just, I want a little bit more shine on it, right? So I just add, I just go over it one more time with some Jachet oil, right? And then what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna go over it with the blow dryer again, okay? Cause now we're about, we're about to get into flat iron mode. We're gonna flat iron this wig. So I'm gonna plug in my Legacy by One flat iron this is my favorite flat iron legacy by one and then royal royal is number two on my on my bucket list on my list when it comes to my favorite flat irons that i live by swear by can't live without okay yep this, when I say it gets so big, this one gets big. So you can wear it either way. If you like it really puffy, it'll look just like your hair. It'll look just like your hair, man. done blow drying okay okay we're done blow drying and now let's start flat ironing I have my little um my little hair wand right here from golden hot that's what I use to flatten the top to make the top really really nice and bone straight and make it where it looks Where's my pillow? Where's my booty pillow? <sighs> Sorry, I gotta be comfortable, huh? Okay? Let me make sure y'all see her really good. Okay, let's bring her back. I can see your comments from over here. I got my iPad over here, so I can see what you're writing. Okay. Now we're gonna take my clips, right? Uh... Hi, Cornelia! Hey, Marcia, hey, sweetheart! All right, we see good, right? We good? All right. So we have her here, and I'm gonna show you what she looks like when we flat iron in her. When I say you gonna fall so in love, because that's why I fall in love over and over again. I fall in love over and over and over and over again, man. I love this wig so much. Now, my next thing that I'm going to apply 
I'm going to apply my Chi 44 Iron Guard. I don't know if anybody uses this. This is one of my favorites. I've been using this for years, years upon years. Some things I just stick with because if it works, if it works, why try to fix something that's not broken, okay? Um, then I have this blow, oh, I already blow dried the hair already, so it doesn't matter now. So we're gonna part this wig apart and we're gonna flat iron her. Rosie, hey, sweetheart, how you doing, honey? How was your day, boo? Let's pull this, let's pull her back. All right, let's pull her back. And let's start this flat iron process. Um, this right here for me is considered training the hair. I do not care about, um, you know how some people just be lazy about it. I gotta go through all the tracks. I need to make sure everything is perfect. If it's not perfect, there's a problem, okay? It has to be because I don't, if just in case if I like, if I want this bone straight or whatever, I want every part of it nice and straight. Okay. Ooh, look at that. Look at, ooh, a child. Do you see that? Oh, that's why I love this wig so much. When I put this on, you're going to be like Jew. And I'm like, I told you sisters, y'all thought I was playing? See, that's why I'm like, I'm very finicky about what kind of wigs I wear. That's why, you know, you, you don't be doing a lot. A lot of companies contact me to do rig reviews, but it doesn't necessarily mean that I believe in the product. If I don't believe in the product, I ain't going to review it and show it to you because I don't want you wasting your money. And I'm not going to say something is nice just to say it's nice, just to make them feel good because I don't care. <laughs> okay, I don't care. All right. Are y'all seeing me good or? All right. That's better. Let me, oh, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. where we go, where we go. Mm -hmm. My son is home. Josiah is home. I'll take that there. Let's comb it through. Oh, child, when I put this wig on, you go, you can't tell me nothing. I'm going to take me a nice fresh shower. Mm -hmm. We're going to train the front. Look, look at that. Look at that. Woo! Ain't that sexy? When your hair is laid, it don't even matter how old your wig is, honey. When you when you be like, yo, my hair is laid, you can't tell me nothing. Don't look. What? What you say? You can look at me, honey. But do you see this hair? Yes, girlfriend. That's what that's all you gotta say. Yes, girlfriend. It it looks good, don't it? Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Mm-hmm. I be trying to lay, honey. You here. Hey, Tutu. How'd you get back on the bus this morning, Josiah? She just let you on? Mm -hmm. Just like that. She she just told you to come on or you just walked to the bus? I walked to the bus. And she didn't say nothing? Mm -hmm. Ain't that something? Don't God love you, honey? God loves you, honey. You hear me? You know God loves you, right, Tutu? Yeah. Very, very much. Because God's looking out for you and mommy, honey. So do you got homework? No, they didn't do They didn't give you no homework? Okay. How was your day at school, boo? Say it again. Well, we're going to go somewhere next week. You want to go to New York? Or you want to stay home? You sh We're going to drive to New York. It's going to be seven hours. It's going to take seven hours for us to get up there. Do you want to go to New York? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. All right. Then we're going to go to New York now. All right. We're going to New York. We'll be going to New York on Sunday then. Because I don't want to stay up there too long. You know, I'll be ready to come home. Hmm? Fast I get up there, the fast I can come back. All right. Now, now at the very top, we're going to go here. Hold it up. Okay. Michelle, you like his hair? Tutu, how's your hair looking? Oh, you have a hat on your head. Why do you have a hat on your head? So you messed up your hair? No. It's not messed up. Where's your waves at? Oh, too bad everybody can't see it. 
Hi, everybody. Let me see if y'all can see Tutu's hair. Come over here, Tutu. I'm going to go over here so y'all can see his hair. Head down. <laughs> Look at Josiah, boy. Look at Josiah, boy. Let's see your outfit too. You look a cute boy. You look at both. Look at my son. Look at my son. <laughs> look at my son. Lord child. Lord child. Yeah. Okay. Make sure your room's clean. Go get your laundry done. Mm -hmm. Go your stuff together. Okay. And go mind the business that pays you. Okay. Now, sisters, look at this side. I don't want to bet that everybody's going to be like, why didn't you have white DCs? What does that mean? White DCs, you know, the all white Nikes, all white low top. Who cares what people say? Who cares? You know, I don't care. Anyway. Now, do you see this, sisters? Do y'all see that? Look at that. Oh, I'm all in y'all way. I'm sorry. Look at that. Let's open it up. Do you see that? Hold on. Because y'all don't see it good enough. I got to make sure you see this. Look, look at that. Ooh. Ooh. And then look, and then you see you have that side, and then look at this side. It's still beautiful on both ends, right? You see the di you see it? Like, hold on, I'm trying to bring back the screen. You see the difference? How it's a little puffy on that end? And then this side when you flat. <laughs> honey, they can't tell you nothing, honey. They can't tell you nothing, honey. They can't tell you nothing, honey. No, no, that they cannot. They cannot. Now you see why I love it so much? I'm telling you. <laughs> it's an addiction, child. Pray for me, honey. Look, I'm trying not to go buy no more wigs, child. And I'm like, yo, I'm really loving my jet black. And I said, this is my I, this is my first jet black wig because I always get like the natural color. But um, if you want jet black, you have to put in one. Jet Number one is for jet black. One B is for... Um, you know, like off black, and then you have the natural color, then you have number two, okay, and it goes that way, okay? So anybody else like, what does that mean? Yep, that's what it means if you don't know, okay? You see that, right? And, but when I put it on, yo, when I put it on, you be like, Jew, and I'm like, sisters, I know, I know, I know, I know. That's why I'm like, that's why I say I'm very particular about, you know, hair that I buy, or and all my hair, you see it, I purchased all these wigs. All these wigs are with my own money. Ain't nobody sponsored nothing, honey. I, I pay for my own wigs. Okay. And I like what I like. I feel like this. You pay for what you like, and you pay you you um you pay whatever it is that you want. You pay for it. Quality versus quantity. I'll pay some money for a wig, and I know it's gonna last me for a long, long time. The only reason why you see it sizzling is because it's still wet underneath at the bottom. But I ain't really worried about that. It'll it'll dry on its own, honey. It'll dry on its own, honey. Okay? Okay, is that there? What's in the wash, Tutu? I put I put your, your mats in the wash. Make sure you mop, huh? I need to put my mats in the dryer. Okay, you need to mop your bathroom floor. Make sure you clean your bathroom. I don't want I don't you don't you don't want to be working doing nothing tomorrow, so make sure your bathroom is clean. Okay, every Friday, sisters, you need to make sure Fridays, especially on Friday. Oh, no, 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 no. Kids are going to clean. They're going to clean because Saturday morning, because you'll be up early Saturday morning. Y'all know what it'd be like in a West Indian home, honey. First thing Saturday morning, everybody's up, everybody cleaning. Everybody's cleaning. No joke. Everybody going to clean. Okay, everybody cleaning, honey. Hey, Shamel. Hey, boo. Who was that? Hey, Miss GT Fab Girl. Hey, boo. This wig is from www.aprillacewigs.com. Aprillacewigs.com. And this is the Italian Yaki. And this is a lace front wig. But I recommend the 360 because you'll have more parting space. But this one, you don't have a lot of parting space. You just have to make it work. And I just made it work. It's just I just fell in love with it. Um, One day, I'm probably going to... I'm going to buy another one one day. But it's going to be a 360 one. It's going to be a 360 so I can have more parting space in it. But this right here, um, Italian Yaki is, has always been my favorite texture because it mimics our hair. And it just looks so realistic. I like wigs that look realistic, that mimic our hair. 
I have other hair textures, you know, the Brazilian, the Indian, and oh, whatever, you know, so keep bone straight and stuff. But if you ask me what's my preference, this is always going to be my preference, you know. Hey, Marie, this is always going to be my preference, period, you know, period, because it mimics our hair. Now, the only um downfall I say to this is that this is not going to hold a curl because it's Italian yaki because that texture it doesn't hold a curl it will hold um you'll get a curl a little bit but it'll have like a nice like say for instance if you do like a tight curl within maybe about an hour to two hours maybe if that too maybe I would say it maybe your curls is going to start dropping so the tighter you curl it the longer it'll hold but you're going to get like a more of a body wave type of look so if you're looking for a a a wig that's gonna give you a tight curl is gonna hold. This is may not. This is not the wig for you. I'm gonna tell you that right now. This is not the wig for you. But after you're done and you do like some nice, um, you'll get like some. It's gonna look more like of a more of a beach wave, if anything. Okay. This is what this is gonna give you. So I don't mind it. I'll curl it or whatever. And if it falls or whatever, it's fine. But it still gives me like a little bounce to it. So that's why I love it. That's right. All right, so that's that. Let's do that there. Since the tracks are so thin and you see how the tracks are thin, but the hair is thick. That's what I love about it. Hello, my graceful Virgo. Hey, sister. What's going on, honey? Happy Friday, everybody. Happy Friday, everybody. Okay, we're going to do that there. Okay, and I'm gonna pass the comb right through it. Okay, I'm gonna do the chase method on it because it helps to separate the hair. If anybody's wondering why do we do this, it helps to separate the hair so that you can get all the strands of the hair. Okay, so you're not missing anything. That's that. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Woo! Whoosh! It's 2:46, right? So I'm doing good timing anyway. I'm doing good timing. Hey, Tutu. Yeah. Make sure I want you um. Bathe by um by five o'clock. Yeah. By five o'clock, I want you in the shower. You hear me? Yeah. Cause I'm taking you out of um, Aunt Carrie's house. All right, look at look at. Do y'all see? Do you see that? <laughs> yes, honey. It gotta be worth it, child. I'll be loving me. You know who's another company that I've been seeing? I've never purchased from them yet, as of yet, but I will. Um, have anybody ever heard of Love Me Hair? I've seen it. I've been seeing the advertisement for it. I've been seeing them on Instagram. And I said, uh, the next place I'm going to go, I'm going to go there. But I'll be so scared because, let me tell you why I'd be scared. Because I just feel like there's no wigs out there like April Lace wigs. And that's the reason why I just won't go anywhere else. Because I know I don't have to panic. I just ordered my wigs, right? Why my wigs are going to be here on Monday? I just ordered them. Just ordered them. They're going to be here on Monday. So it's about a week, a week, week and a half, if that. I think that's really good coming from um, China, wherever it's coming from. All right, now look at that. Hey, Pamela. Hey, honey. You see that? Tutu! Yeah. Mr. Lamar is outside. Give him those packages. He's right in front of Miss Laura's house. The packages are right in front of the door. You see them? Ooh, we almost missed them. You got them? Okay, give it to him for me. All right. Yay! Every, all, all my all my customers who ordered um yesterday and today. I shipped all your packages got shipped. Mr. Lamont is picking up your packages. <laughs> That's how we do. You know, when I be in the house and stuff, you know, I be shipping. Especially if I see, especially if I see Mr. Lamont. Everybody know who my mailman is, Mr. Lamont. I call my mailman. I'm like, I'm like, Mont, are you in the area? And he's like, you got some packages? I said, yep, Mont, I got packages. And he'll take your packages and everything. He'll scan them and everything. So, um, that's how I'm able to get your stuff out so fast because I call my mailman to see what he at. If he's in the area, you know, especially if I'm not busy and I ain't doing anything like, you know, my shipment days every Thursday. Um, I was doing it on Monday, but Monday's a busy, hectic day for me because I'll be trying to do other stuff. I got too much stuff going on. So and I'll ship out. And then but like I said, for me, if I'm free on a day where I'm not doing anything, I ain't got nothing going on or whatever. I'll ship out every day if I can. 
as long as I'm not, you know, tied up doing other things. But once I get a little free time, I always try to put in at least two, you know, probably put in like two hours so that I can ship out my products. I can ship everybody's orders out because I, I get excited when y'all get y'all orders, boy. <laughs> Who you don't be that excited? Ju, me, I do, honey. I, I get very excited when you guys get your shipments. All right, so now let's, he got them? Yeah. Thanks, boo, thank you. Yeah, All right. Hey, make sure the dishes in the sink are washed, baby cakes. Okay. okay. All right. Loving me, Gio. Hey, sweetheart. Haven't I seen your picture before? You've been here before, right, boo? But, I mean, you probably commented on one of my videos. Because your picture looks familiar. Welcome to the family, honey. I didn't announce that I was going live anywhere, guys. I told you. I'm very spontaneous. So, it's kind of like when I feel like popping on, I'll pop on and stuff, you know? You know? So, I'm sorry. But everybody, please welcome our new sister. Welcome to the family, girlfriend. Hey, is there anything in particular that we want to talk about today while I'm flat ironing this wig, honey? Anything in particular that we want to talk about? Any questions anybody wants to ask? I don't mind. You know, I'm just flat ironing the wig. So, we could chat up, chat up, chat up, chat up, chat up. And let's chat. Let's talk. Yeah! What did you order, boo? Tell me what you ordered. And also, I got a question. How did how, how did you find? That's what I always want to know. How did you find out about my products? So how did you find? Yeah, how did you find out about my products? For me, um, I received my package. Thank you. I was surprised to receive. Girl, I don't be playing. You see, not you see. There you go, right there. I don't play when it comes to my packages, sisters. Nope, I don't play with that. I want y'all to have y'all stuff. When I see orders pop up, like guys, I can ship a hundred orders in a day. I will start at four o'clock in the morning and I won't stop until everything is packaged, okay? That's how I move. I'm so excited for you guys to get your packages from me because I care about what I do and I wanna help, you know? So this that's what I do, I help. And if I'm sitting here free and I ain't got nothing going on, you get what I'm saying? Like if I've got my, um, my, um, my products in stock and I ain't out of stock or whatever, I'm sitting right here and I'm working. So if y'all don't see me, I'm like, yo, where's Juju at? I'm working, guys. I'm working. I take my little nap in the afternoon, you know, and then I chill, you know, like I said, chill with my kids, make dinner, everything like that. Everybody eats. Homework is done. Everybody's nicely relaxed. Once that's done, who's, who's that? Hi, Miss Sharon. Hey, sweetheart. Hey, honey. Once all that stuff is done, look, I'm up late at night. While most people are sleeping, I'm up working, you know? So I'll be trying to get these packages out. I'll be playing. That I, and I'll be sitting here doing this off this stuff all by myself. My kids will come home like in the afternoon or whatever. Um, my kids will be home. They'll help me. They'll do as much as they um they can. You know they want to. They give me. They'll give me. Look, they'll sacrifice and give me about a good two hours of their time. And when they do that, boom, they go about their business, go do what they gotta do, and I keep on working. And I'll be trying to get y'all packages out. You know, I got friends everywhere, child. You hear me? My post. Look, my post office love me, honey. My post office love me. Because I live at the post office. I live there. So. LaShonda, hey, boo. How you doing, honey? Yo, look at the hair. Do you see? Do y'all see that? Oh, my God. Miss Sharon, this came from April A. Switch, boo. This is an Italian yaki. Italian yaki wig. It mimics our hair. That's why I just love it so much. And you see how much I'm taking a big chunk of it? And you're looking like, Dad, you're taking a big chunk. No. The hair is thick, but the... the okay. See how you have the track? The track is so thin, but the hair is thick. But when you fly on, you see how it comes out? It's like, yo. I'm new and found you by watching your BBL videos. I watched one of your videos and fell in love with your authenticity. And girl, you... Sister Gio. Gio, is that your first name? You know, I'd be liking to know y'all names and stuff. Gio, what, is that your first name, boo? Thank you, honey. Um, you know what's so funny? Let me say this. I was contemplating about even coming on YouTube and even doing videos about my procedure and stuff, you know? Because you know how some people are, whatever, which I don't care. And I'd be like, yo, I would curse somebody out. So before we go there, how about, because they don't know. They just see that side. But I said, nah, they don't know this other side, child. And I don't be trying to show out, but... I said, you know what? It comes with the territory, Jew. You know, do you really care? No, you don't. And I, you know, really thought about wanting to have to put that on display. But I said, you know, I want to help people. Because I'm like, there's a lot of ladies out here who want to get this procedure done. 
they don't even know they don't even know what they need and pe and i've watched so many youtube videos people will only tell you what they want to tell you they'll just tell you just to get the views but it's not because they actually care you know if you go to the right person or if you have the right things and things like that or if you know the right information they're just doing it for views now i'm not gonna sit here and say well yo like hey i'm getting views but at the end of it was i expecting to get views off of my videos no i wasn't expecting to i mean it is what it is but i know that I'm real. I'm a, I'm, I'm a real mofo, you know? And I just want to make sure that when I put something out there, I don't want to miss nothing. I want everybody to know. I want you to be informed. And you need to know what you're getting yourself into. I need you to know how much money you about to spend because this ain't cheap. Some people might think it's cheap. This ain't cheap, honey. Okay? Oh, you're welcome. You're welcome, Asia. You're so welcome, beautiful. You know, this ain't cheap. I just want to make sure that you're just prepared. So, um, let me tell you what has happened. I've had, I've, yo, when I tell, I'm getting so many people who are purchasing my Jachet oil and my butter, you know, due to the itching. And I said, yo, I don't use anything. Ask me, would you, what do you use for your itching? Just Jachet oil and the butter is what helped my itching. That's why I didn't have a lot of itching. I didn't itch a lot. I itched, but I didn't, it wasn't like extreme, like how other people have it. They go, I'm about to die. And I'm like, my itching wasn't extreme. I just used my products. That was it. And because of that, these videos and stuff that I did, I've got so many women purchasing um, Jache oil um, and the butter for that, but they're not even really like, I didn't know you could use it on you. I'm like, boo, read, read the description of what you're purchasing. Jache oil is for your hair and your body. You know, it's for your hair and your body. So um, it's beneficial for you. Now, if you have, like, you know, summertime is coming, mosquito bites, apply the Jache oil. If you get a mosquito bite, put the jachet oil right on it. You know what's going to happen? I promise you within two to three hours, that mosquito bite will be gone. Your itching will be gone instantly. It'll stop the itching instantly, okay? If you have um, arthritis, pain, muscle aches, things to that nature, okay? It helps to aid in those things. I ain't cure nothing. You don't cure nothing, honey. You don't cure nothing. My project is help aiding in, okay? Aiding in. Because y'all know, right? Mm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Oh my, yeah, you're going to itch like crazy, girl. You're going to itch like crazy. The itching is to some, is unbearable. Man, I said, Lord have mercy. And I said, when I went out, I was like, oh, this like, I'm itching so bad. What do I do? And I'm like, buy my products. Buy my products. Buy my products. It'll help you. It'll help you. Buy my products. It's going to help. You know? So I like to hear when someone, like, especially like if you hit, usually I read it this time because I know a lot of people are purchasing um, my oil just because I'll make it just a little bit stronger. I've made it. I didn't, I didn't go for my price or nothing like that. I made it just a little bit stronger all because I'm like, I know a lot of people are purchasing because of the itching too, you know? So I like intensified it a little bit more, honey, and it helps. It relieves so much. It relieves so much of that itchiness. Yes, Pamela, it sure is. It sure is, my love. It sure is. Just if y'all read the description of my products, it'll tell you exactly what it's good for. If you follow me on Instagram, if you follow Jashay Essentials on Instagram, um, I tell you what my products are good for, what they do. If you go on my website, you'll see what um, the benefits of my products are. But Jashay Oil is really good for eczema, psoriasis, dry skin, dry scalp. Okay, and dandruff, it's really good for that as well. And you great, it's great for a hot, you can also use it for a hot oil treatment as well, okay? Okay. You are so welcome, boo. And um, another thing too, guys, too, right? Does anybody eat cilantro? If you are not consuming cilantro, you need to go get yourself some cilantro. Do you know that cilantro removes heavy metals out of the body? Okay. Do y'all know, we, you know we have all kinds of metals in our bodies, right? Okay. So it helps to remove these toxins and these heavy metals out of our body. So if you don't have um, cilantro um, in your grocery list, you need to add it. Okay, you really need to add it. Um, green tea is really, really good um, for the inflammation as well. Okay, for the swelling, it's really, really good. Arnica tea, you can get yourself some arnica tea on Amazon as well too. That's really good as well. Okay, um, drink pineapple juice. Before surgery, make sure you are drinking pineapple juice. After surgery, you're drinking pineapple juice. Drink pineapple juice. Now, the the better the benefit of the pineapple juice, the pineapple is, is if you peel off the skin. If you peel off the skin off the pineapple and you boil it, that is going to help you with your inflammation. I'm telling you, it tastes disgusting. Listen to me now. 
It tastes disgusting. But when I tell you, it will work wonders for you. You'll be like, Jew. I'm like, yes, honey. Yes. Beet, beet juice, guys, have beet smoothies. It's really, really good for your blood. Okay, really good for your blood. You want to keep away blood clots and things of that nature. Please make sure you're getting up and you're moving around. Do not, I, I repeat, you get your rest, but make sure you are moving around. Recommendations, do not fly before seven days. If you are having BBL, if you're having um, Lipo 360, before you start, after you start, you need to be waiting at least seven days. I'll tell you 14, that's what I really want to say, but seven days is the least. Do not fly before that. Okay, when you are on the plane, make sure you have compression socks on. I can't stress that enough. Why do I need to wear compression socks, Juju? You need to wear compression socks because if you do not, you are more prone to get blood clots in your legs. Okay, because of all that pressure. All right? All right? All that elevation. You need to be wearing compression socks. Okay? Am I missing anything? Anybody wrote nothing? Oh, nobody wrote nothing? Okay. I thought somebody wrote something. Okay, that's that. Let's do this here. All right. Let's go here and do this. Any more? Any questions? Mm, I'll wait. If you have any questions, I'll answer it while I'm here. I should have probably announced that I was going to go on live, but mm, we get to spend our time, so it's all, it's all good. Oh, I'm trying to think. Can you tell us about the new soap? Oh, <laughs> Chanel, you so slick. So, sisters, I complete. So, guys, I, they go Chanel. They go Chanel starting her stuff. Hey, guys, so I have a new soap on my website, which is the cookie soap. Okay, it's the cookie soap bar. Juju, what is the cookie soap bar? The cookie soap bar is for the coochie, honey. Okay, it's for the coochie. It's for the JJ. All right. I specifically made a soap that is good for the vagina, period. Okay. If you are very sensitive, this soap has no scent to it. It, if you are sensitive, this soap is really good for babies. This is a this is the baby soap. This is the soap that you want to use on your children. And also, you can use this soap on your pets. But this right here is the cookie soap. You can use it on your cookie. Your man can use it too. Not just you, boo. Everybody can use it on their nookies, okay? And it doesn't have a smell. And not only that, when you, know, when you finish watching, you know how... Don't front, okay? If you don't want to say you don't have to, it's okay. So check this out, right? <laughs> Is it good? Miss, my, you missed my question. Is what good for um two year olds? Beijing, you must be new. If you new boo, um, if you check out my FAQ page, my FAQ page will tell you everything you need to know. You can start using my products after two months old. Two months old. Two months old to use the Juche oil. You gotta be two months old, okay, to start using it. Um, what was I saying? Sorry, I forgot. Yeah, I know I got uh, you know I got short term memory loss, right? Sorry, I get distracted very easily. <laughs> Look how fast we're going through this wig, man. Oh, my God. It's so beautiful. You know what I forgot to do? I forgot to put my phone on Do Not Disturb to make sure nobody. Uh, okay. What was that? What was I about to? I was about to say something. Oh, yes, 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 yes. So, you know how sometimes when you wash your bottom or whatever and stuff like that, right? You wash your bottom and still, even after you wash, you still have a little smell. I didn't say a stank smell. But you still have a vajayjay -jay smell, right? You get what I'm saying, right? You want to take that away? Use that cookie soap and you see. <laughs> Tell them. Say, boo, come to smell it. Come smell it. Tell me what you smell. Say, close your eyes and count to five. Close your eyes and count to five. Smell it. Tell me what you smell. I don't smell nothing. You don't smell nothing? That's right. That's right. That's right. Smell nothing. So whatever it is that you want to put on top of that, there's not going to be no smell, okay? <laughs> no smell, okay? I, when I say it feels... It's nice. It's nice, honey. It's nice, honey. I said to call it the cookie soap. <laughs> my mom was like, Jew, what is this? She said, oh, my God. She said, look, she's like, she's like, you know, like, she's like, I, I like it. I like it, doll. I like it. She's like, it's scent. She's like, you don't have no scent. I said, nope, this one don't have no scent. No scent. Because you don't want no essential oils down there. You don't You don't want nothing. You don't want that. You're not, not, not for no soap. You don't want that. Okay, you don't want that. You don't want no fragrances down there for that. Nope, you don't want that either. Not with the soap. Definitely not with the soap, okay? Bayesian princess, you're not new. If you're not new, sis, how you didn't know? Well, you probably, you you might be new to my products because if you're not new to my products, you would know my FAQ page is stated there, my love. 
But yeah, it's after two months old. Perfect. But you know what? But it was it was a good question anyway because you might you might not know or you might know and somebody else might come in and have the same question and they may not know. So um, I think you'd for advance for anybody new who comes in, sis. I think you advance for that question because somebody new who might come in and they'll be like, well, can I use it on you know my two month old or you know my six month old, my two year old? They're not sure. So thanks for that, boo. Thank you. You know. So, but yeah, we we gotta take care of our nookies, honey. We gotta take care of our nookies. We gotta take care of nookie, honey. <laughs> oh my gosh! Look how it's oh my god, how slaying. I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go back on this. But this is where I'm gonna use the the what you call it. I'm thinking about doing these crimps on it. I really want to put these crimps. Woo! But since I wash it, I don't want to put no spritz spray on the hair. I just want the hair to flow. Oh, child. Wait till I put her on. Wait till wait, you wait. Sisters, you wait. You just wait. I knew two baby. Uh, my youngest is 17. It's hey Sandra. Hey, honey. <laughs> hey, boo. Yes, because you don't know, like. What we don't realize is that a lot of the soaps that we use and don't realize that, you know, that we're throwing off the pH balance, okay? You're throwing it off, all right? So you don't want to use any type of, like, people who want to get Summer Eve, you shouldn't be using any Summer Eve that have fragrances to them. You should not. You, not at all. But, you know, a lot of people don't know that. You shouldn't at all. It throws off your pH balance. But they won't tell you that. They won't tell you that, though, you know? They will definitely won't tell you that. I prefer when you make call dress videos because I can watch. <laughs> ah! <laughs> well, this is a hair video. That's This is what my channel is about, boo. Hair, makeup, and stuff. So this may not be the video for you, boo. Not today. But I'll be getting I'll be getting dolls up later. I'll be doing makeup. I'm gonna well, you probably don't care about that neither. But hey, but you'll be able to see me. I'll be doing makeup in a little bit. I gotta take a shower. I just wanted to um finish my wig. I gotta prep, we're gonna prep the front of my hair, and then I'm gonna put my scarf on. But I'm going to show you how to prep the front of your hair. And then we're going to set this wig on and everything like that. And we're going to slay, honey. We're going to slay. I don't even I don't even know what I'm wearing, guys. Hey, Tutu, did I get any mail? Yeah. All right. Thank you. Never mind. All right. No, leave it, leave it, leave it. I don't want nothing upstairs right now. Thank you. Thank you. Let's flat iron this out. Is your room, what you doing, Tutu? What you doing? What you doing, Tutu? Come here. What instructions did I give you? I did it. You cleaned your bathroom? You mopped your bathroom floor? I mopped my bathroom and I did the dishes downstairs. What is your floor? What does your bathroom floor smell like? What does it smell like right now? It just smell like what you call it, pee or nothing. No, what I want to know what does it smell like? What did you spray in your bathroom? Of the um bathroom cleaner thing that was under my sink. Okay. And you use a mop? Mm-hmm. Okay. Good. So your bathroom is intact? Mm -hmm. All right. Do I need to come and inspect it? You can if you want to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, okay. All right. Okay. I'll trust you. I'll leave you be. Ooh, sisters, look at my girlfriend, honey. Honey, look at my girlfriend. Why can't I, um, uh, what is this? why can't I do that too? That's messed up. Tutu Auntie Tasha says hi. Oh, his door must be closed, Tash. All right, let's flat on that real quick right here. No, I got to put these crimps in. And I'm going to do a little bit by little, okay? Don't you used to drink good for managing cookie pH balance? Noni juice is really good too. Noni juice is good. But see, what, let me tell you what I use. Noni juice, when I recommend noni juice, is because of people who have cancer. Okay? That's why I recommend that. Okay? Noni juice, Zango juice, Noni juice, cancer. Cancer, cancer, sour sap. I drink sour sap every single day. I've been telling you guys about sour sap forever. 
but not everybody listens. But you know, I saw they wouldn't go post it on the shade room. Now everybody's gonna jump on, you know, jump on it. But I've been telling y'all all this information for years, but nobody wanna listen. But it's okay. You know anybody got cancer? Noni juice, Zango juice, okay? Sour sap, okay? Make sure you drink a celery juice. I love celery juice. I just love celery, period. Okay. Now check this out, sisters. Ooh, ooh, to the ooh, ooh, ooh. Now look at her. Do you see how nice and bouncy she is? Now what I'm going to do is... You said am I... Yes, I am a hairdresser. I am a hairdresser. Yes, I am. Do I, I don't do hair anymore. I'm lazy. I don't have time to do that. I don't really care to. That's just what it is. I don't have, I don't want to stand on my feet and I don't want to work um, that hard on my back. It's too much on my back. Um, so I am a licensed. So if you're new here and this is your first time seeing me, um, I am a licensed cosmetologist and also a licensed educator. Okay. I have over 20 years in this hair industry, in this hair, hair, hair industry. Okay. Um, I am a hair care specialist, period, period. I care for hair, all right? Um, I am one of those type of stylists that I don't, I'm not going to, you might want what you want and that's cool and there's nothing wrong with that. But if it is going to be detrimental to your hair, I won't do your hair. I'll fire you. I fire my clients, okay? And that's how I can get because I care about your hair, all right? I care about your hair. And what we're not going to do, you're not not on my watch. If you want to go do some craziness to your hair, go to somebody else. Let them do that. But you'll be back. They always come back. See, but I got impatient with that. People want to do all kinds of craziness to their hair. And then they want to come back to me to fix it. And I don't got that kind of patience anymore. I can't stand on my feet like that anymore like I used to. And I have carpet tunnel as well. So I'm studying, I'm studying in a hairstyle camp. It's unisex, but I want to be a barber. Oh, yes. Yes, honey. Get all the licenses you can get. Get all the licenses you can get. That's 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 how I tell you. Get them all. Okay? Get them all. Okay, I'll do this with me. All right, so that's done. Ooh, we honey. Look at our girlfriend, honey. Look at our girlfriend, girls. Is the stuff for cancer on your page? Um, I have videos that I've talked about it. Just type in Noni, N-O-N-I, Zango, X-A-N-G-O on Amazon and Sour Sap. I probably did put, I did put those links up there one day. Yes, I did. I did. But it's been a while. Look at, look. Do you see her? Bump. You know, look what happened to the poise pad. She got ripped through. Oh, man. Okay. We're going to have to take the poise pad off. We ripped her in half. Didn't even realize we ripped her in half. But it's... Man, but let's see if we can get her down again. There she goes. There she goes. There she goes. There she goes. All right. I think I'm going to tape her around. Now, Drew, what's the next thing that we're going to do? What we're going to do is we're going to take out our wand curler. Okay. And now what we're going to do is we're going to train the top of this wig. We want this wig to be so sexily flatly sleek so we're going to train the top so i'm going to plug this in i'm going to plug her in and everything oh she hasn't been used in a while what happened here okay she hasn't been used in a while let's turn her here there she goes all right let's turn her on and let's max her out all right and now Here what we're gonna do now sisters let me turn her around let's make sure that the parting is cool let's make sure we're satisfied with the parting parting is perfect we are going to take this where did i get this from I probably got this from my local beauty supply store this is called luster's rea nutrient slick stick sculpt smooths edges defines and holds style we're going to take that here and we are going to put this over the flyaways i never even used the thing well whatever Okay, we're gonna put that over the flyaways. Cause we wanna train her to stay down and we don't want those flyaways in our way, okay? We don't want those flyaways in our way. Never used this one before, I guess, so. There's one particular that I do have, I just haven't seen it, don't know where it's at. Okay. All right, 
Now we got that. We got that right here. Hold on. Put that right there. We're going to take our, our tail comb. We're going to take a little bit of our spritz spray. Okay, we're going to take a little bit of spritz, but we're not going to spray it directly on the hair. We're going to spray it on our hands. Come on, friend. Come on, friend. Really? Did it detach? Something happened? Why? Brand new bottle. You see that, right? Oh, it takes some time. Look, it takes some time for it to come out. Okay, now rub my hands together like this, right? And then I just pass it on the hair, on top of the hair, just like this, just like so. Now I'm gonna take my comb. I'm gonna take my comb and train the hair on how I want it to lay, okay? Train the hair on how I want it to lay. In this case, usually I should take my hot comb out. I should take out my hot comb, right? Ah, I should take out my hot comb, but it's in that corner and I don't wanna open up the drawer, open up that bag. Okay, I'm gonna end up having to open up the bag, man. Mmm. Oh, that sucks. We gotta, we gotta get it out. So. Exactly what you're looking for. You can't find it. Where is my hot comb? How about the hot comb is not even in there? Ain't that something? Is a hot comb in here? Is a hot comb in here? Nope. The hot comb in here. You know what? I ain't got time. All right, Jewin got patience. Okay, now what we're gonna do is we're going to take the Got To Be Glue glued um, blasting free spray and we're going to go 10 inches away from the hair because I don't want it directly on the hair, okay? We don't want it directly on the hair, okay? Bam, just like that, right? Now what we're gonna do is we're going to take, we are going to take a little curling wand and we're going to press. Now hold the tip just like so and we're gonna hold the tip and we're gonna bring it down slowly because our goal is to train it so that it can be so flat it, it looks real we need to be we need to be so flat that it looks so real okay and the reason why i tell you to hold the end of the tip like this you should wear your protective gloves but hold the tip like this so that you can put pressure on it okay you can put pressure on it and so you can keep yourself from burning yourself as well okay i'll see you later if you go live jesus says i have to take some care of it all right honey but i love you love you boo we'll see you later all right okay let's put that there Susie is on it today honey look at Susie. look at Susie. Susie being fresh guys Susie is being fresh see i need my little hot comb just for that side right there but it's okay because i'm gonna show you what i'm gonna do Susie is being fresh with us on today, honey. Susie's like, girl, do you like me, honey? Do you see me, honey? Do you see me? I'm late, girlfriend. I'm late. You can't tell me nothing. Don't come for me. Make sure we trim right there. See how I'm training it? When I say it is so laid and not going nowhere, no to the where. This is where the hot comb will come in handy, especially like right here. See? I gotta put a little pressure with my flat iron since I don't know where my flat iron, my um, hot comb is right now. Did 
do this here too. Get a little bit of close. I do have Afro hairstyles. One day I'll put one on. But majority, that's what you see me in. I love my Afro hairstyles. One of my Afro wigs I threw it away today because the hair was really old. And I just wasn't, I just didn't feel like taking it apart. I wasn't in the mood. I got some more hair. One day I'll make more of it. All right. Now, I want to give it like this nice um body wave type of look. If my where's my iron? Where'd I put the, oh, there she goes. There she goes right here. There she goes. Look, look, look. So I bought this iron. Um, I don't know where. I think I probably must have got it at Sally's. So I'm going to plug her up. And we're going to put these little beach looking waves. They're crimps. I love crimps. And that's what we're going to put. I haven't used this. I haven't used this in a while. It's been a while since I've used it. We're going to plug her up. Right now. And we're going to put some waves, some little wave patterns in here some waves in here for her. Okay, let me look right here so I can see your comments. Hey, good. As for J, J-A. Hey, boo. All right, let's bring this back. You were talking about the cookie soap. Oh, oh, I know I finished talking. I think I finished talking. I don't think there was anything else that I had to say. I don't think there was anything else that I had to say about it. Just that, you know, we need to take good care of our cookies. That's all. We need to take good care of our cookies. You know? Some don't know how to, and it's okay. That's why we learn. That's why we come here. We come in and we learn. All right? And another thing, too, is remember what you are what you eat. You are what you eat. You eat a lot of fruits and berries. You want to eat fruits and berries? You want it, you want it to taste sweet? You want it to taste sweet? You know what you need to be doing, right? Right? <laughs> All right. Oh, can y'all see the front, sisters? Look. Y'all see the front? You wait. You wait, honey. You wait. Let me make sure I turned her on. Did I turn her on? Oh, shucks. This thing got hot. Oh, my God. She got hot so quick. All right. So now let's start taking her apart. We're gonna start at the bottom. We're gonna start at the bottom. Let me get these clips out the way. Let me get these clips here so we can give her some nice little crimps. Okay, honey? Let's get. Hey, Jean. Hey, sweetheart. All right. Let's part this out. Because I'm not doing them really small or anything, which I really would. I ain't got that kind of time. Do I? Yes, I, yes, I kind of do. But do I really want to? No, I don't. Okay, so we're going to cut this in three. We're going to move that to the side. The hair is so... Do you see how soft this hair looks? Do you see how it flows, sisters? All right. Now let's break this apart. And let's just do pieces by piece. Because I just want to... I want to give this body wave look. Okay, so let me not make it too big. And we're good. You can get this here from Sally's. That's where I got it from, from Sally's. And I want it to be soft. Um, I'll, no, let me not do that. Mm -mm, it'll be all right. I just want it to be nice and soft. This might take a little bit. <laughs> what am I missing? Okay. Okay. Uh, Ooh, look at that. Do y'all see that? Honey, this is about to be so pretty. This thing gets so hot. It's been a while. Where do you order your wigs from? Sis, I, this wig came from April Lace Wigs, my love. That's where I go, boo. April Lace was love of my life, girl. 
Love of my life, honey. I've been purchasing from them since 2013. So, and the reason why I purchased from them because I know what I'm going to get, you know? You, do, hold on. Let me open this up so y'all can see. Because y'all can't see. Y'all really got to see you and be like, oh, now I see. I see you. I do. I see. When I was a kid, this is all. Yo, my hair was always in crimps. Always in crimps. You couldn't tell me nothing, honey. Yeah, do you see that? Child, we trying to snack, snatch necks around these parts, honey. Okay, okay, okay. You know this takes patience. You got to have patience for this. See, what I like is that the, the, the iron is hot. It gets really hot. Child, you know when I put this on, I'm going to be mad pretty. I'm going to be so cute. Because I'm extra. Let me make sure because I want to make sure I get the hair. You see how nice and soft because I didn't put no spritz spray or nothing like that. I didn't want to put spritz spray on it because I want it to be nice and soft. And it's going to and it mimics our hair, too. You know, you know, I can tell you nothing, honey. <laughs> oh my god now if you have an issue with placement let me turn it a little bit so y'all can see right now you see how wherever the bottom is at watch this I'm going to hold this like so right wherever it stopped where that next cleft is I go right over it okay This is going to take a while, but I've got patience. That's if y'all got patience to sit and watch. If you don't, it's okay. Y'all can always come back or you can fast forward the video later. Unless anybody got any kind of questions or whatever, we can chat it up. I don't mind. We can talk about anything. It's Friday too. So, you know, there's no filter at this point. <laughs> I just want to make sure I don't burn myself because I don't need no burns. See, nice and soft. Wait, oh man, wait till I comb it out. So if you have some straight hair and you want that nice body wave look, this is what you would do. You get yourself these little crimp, crimp irons. Like you can get this at, um, you can get this at, what do you call it again? Um, Sally's Beauty Supply Store. You said it makes you hungry? Honey, I'm already hungry myself. But I'm not going to eat now because I want my stomach to be flat. And you see I'm compressed. I am When I say I'm compressed, I'm compressed right now. I need to make another purchase from the Jachet. Do you have larger sizes? Larger sizes as far as what, boo? Whatever you see on the website is what's there, boo. Because I used to have 8-ounce Jache oils, um, like I said, but once I got, people complained about the 8-ounce and they wanted the 4-ounce, so I made the 4-ounce. Then we got back to everybody, I said, what about the 8-ounce? So it's either or. I might start making some more 8-ounce bottles because I did get some more 8-ounce bottles. So um, I don't know when, maybe in a couple of weeks, maybe. Maybe next month or something, I might make some more. All depends on my level of business. Sure I get everything in because I don't want to miss a beat. I want to. It gets hot though. This thing gets really hot. When I say hot, this thing gets hot. Now, I don't know if it just says on. It doesn't give me, you know, it doesn't give me like a setting of can I make it less hot or nothing? It doesn't give me that kind of setting. Look at that. Ooh. Ooh. 
I just want to get through this so that I can do my makeup. Then when I come home tonight, work on Juju's hair. <laughs> so, oh, if anybody, I'm from Brooklyn, New York. My kids said they want to go to New York. I don't want to go to New York right now. I don't. I ain't gonna lie because I don't want to drive. I don't like long drives and I don't like being out of my house. Anybody knows I love being in my house and I don't like going outside much. I only go outside because I have to, not because I want to. <laughs> not because I want to. Okay, there that goes. Let's do another part. Let's do another part. Okay. Is that too much? Let me see. Maybe that's a little bit too much. If I had nowhere to go, it would be much thinner than this. Shawarna, hey boo, hey sweetheart. How's your day, honey? Happy Friday. Only because nobody's really gonna see everywhere else. You don't have to really stress on going all the way to the root. You kind of want the root to be a little bit straight too so we can lay down so it's not giving you a hump. And look, notice how I'm doing this. You need to turn it like this so that it can lay down because you don't want it sticking out, okay? You don't want it sticking outwards. You want it going inwards, okay? Now bring it down. Make it nice and soft, okay? And it's still gonna be nice and flowy and everything because I didn't put no spritz or any, no hard crimps on it. Ah, oh, I've been twice times and I've been in Flatbush, Bedside, Bushwick, Brownsburg, Crown Heights. And I'm from Crown Heights, Brooklyn. Yeah, that's where I'm from. Yeah, I'm Crown Heights, Brooklyn. I think I just might go to Maryland and go spend time with my mom. But she's in, she goes to work during the day. That's why I'm just like, I could be home, I could be working. I could be productive, but I want to do something with my kids. So really, New York is the place I really want to go? No. But I'm going to, I have some activities. I could take them to the zoo. We can go to the aquarium out here. But I think they have an aquarium in D.C. or something like that. I've heard about it. But I've never been, but I've heard about it. Wow, was that the wind? You see how fast I'm doing this and how it's going so I don't even have to hold it long. I'm gonna say six seconds. Let's do this one and see how. One, two, three, four. Wow, at four seconds it'll, so I don't even have to hold it long. Wow, I'm just holding it long by myself but I really don't have to. Okay, let's go here. And do this on this side you see how I already trained the top of the hair right so when I do it the hair is already laid and it's gonna be so pretty don't want to go all the way to the root because I don't want it bulky remember how I say turn to make sure it's turned in make sure it's turned in the longer you keep it the harder the crimp is going to be For people who don't have this kind of, I'll do stuff like this. Yeah. This I have patience for. I could do this all day. I could watch um, Dexter and everything, honey. Can you see that? Oh, look how beautiful that looks. Wow. Okay. Did you like it? So the only thing that sucks is if you have carpet tunnel, because now my, my, you know, my hands hurt, but it'll be all right. I don't care. My hand can hurt, but I'm going to get this hair done. Believe it. Believe it. Mmm. 
Got it. Ooh. Look at here, look at here. Woohoo. You say you love Okay. Yeah, ask if you liked it. Do I miss home? No, not at all. I miss home for the food. That's about it. I miss home for the food. That I definitely can say. But as far as anything else, no. no. See, I was always a homebody anyway back home. I didn't. I wasn't in the streets or anything like that. I was always home. I was either I was home or I was working. That that's all I did. I worked and I, you know, like I said, I went to school and worked. You know, took care of my household, helped take care. You know, my sisters with my mama, and that's it. That that was. Dad, do I want to do that? Nope, I don't want to do that. I need to part that because we want the crimps to be up here somewhere. So I can't do that. I was about to do this. And just realize what I was doing. Can't do that. Mm -mm. Let's do that here. Let's put that there. And let's go right here. Okay. And see how I have it right here? And then I turn it in. I bend it in so that the hair can lay flat. If I do it out, the hair is going to um, um, stick out and you don't want that. So you want to make sure you have it close to the head. Okay. That's why you have that plate right here, there. But it's so big anyway, so. Ooh, don't do that, honey. Don't do that. Patience. Sorry, no music. Don't want YouTube to flag me. You miss soul food? <laughs> Hi, LV. Hey, beautiful. Welcome, honey. Everybody's so quiet today. I know this is kind of like boring. I just like that it's gonna, you know, that I just know it's gonna flow. That's what I'm excited about. Alvy, did you get a notification to let you know I was live or you just had to happen to be scrolling and saw that I was live? Cause I'd be wondering if anybody gets their notifications. Oh, you did get it? Okay, okay. Because I be feeling, I'm like, it's not giving nobody no notifications and letting them know that I'm on. And that's why I'm like, I always got to like go and let people, I'm like, hey guys, I'm on live. I'm live. Okay. I think I kind of want to leave that alone for now. Only because, do I really need to? No, I don't. I don't. I don't have to. Let's just do this one. Let's do this crimp. So we just do this row is already done. So we don't got to worry about it no more. Okay. So I make sure I turn it in. Okay. I make sure I turn it in so we can lay. I eat pasta every day. Really? You did? Okay, good. Sandra, I was wondering, I'm like, I wonder if it's even sending any notifications out and stuff. You know, YouTube want to play when they want to play, honey. See, now look, the top one is so important because that's what everybody's going to see. So that's why you got to be careful with the top. Take your time. Don't rush the top, especially the top one. Because you want it to lay nice. I hold a little bit long only because I just want them crimps to be fly. Oh, 
that looks so beautiful. This would have been easier if I had a bigger one. I think I might go invest in a bigger one. During the lunch, every Italian beef tastes different. Yeah. <laughs> All right, now we so this side of this side will practically be done, and then we can start on the other side. And make sure you do not disturb all the work that you did in the front where you flattened out the front. Now, remember, I don't go close to the root. Because I don't want it raised up off. I want that still kind of straight. I want it laying down. So you want to go at least about a, uh, two inches away from the hairline, from the from the hairline, working your way down. Oh, I gotta take a picture of this, honey. Oh my god, this is just too beautiful. Sauce Alfredo, you don't eat fettuccine Alfredo too. It's an Italian American culture. Wow, so what do y'all eat then? Wow, I didn't know that. That's new, didn't even know that. Why wow, you learn something new every day? Didn't even know that. Wow. <laughs> no! Use the one just like. It on plain side. Use the wand. What do you use the wand for? Oh, that hurt. Oh, my hand hurt. Mm. This is why I don't do hair anymore. Use the wand, just slide it on the plain side. What do you mean use the wand? Use the wand for what? I don't need the wand. Oh, my hand, my hand, my hand. Okay, now we turn it right here at the bottom so it can go underneath. Some days I'm just like, well, I can't believe I've been doing hair for so long. Not that I get tired of it. No, it's just I don't have time anymore. All right, there's that. Let's do another one right here. Let's cut this off. So I'm probably going to have two more pieces left, not too much. Okay, so I can get through this faster. All I think I know what you mean. You mean like turn the, the other opposite? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I like to see my print. I like to see exactly where I put it. I just got what you were saying, sis. I just got what you were saying. <laughs> Do y'all actually want me to stay on live until I finish doing this? Or can I just come back after I'm done? I think y'all seen enough of it, right? 
When I start doing my makeup and put my hair on and all that stuff, whatever, then y'all can see because I'll come back on live again for that. I'm more than likely going to go on Facebook. I'm not going to come on YouTube. Matter of fact, this is what I'll do. Oh, my hand hurt. I'm going to finish doing my crimps. I think y'all have seen enough. Y'all got the gist of what I'm doing, right? Yeah. I'm, I'm not going to come back for makeup. I'm going to be on Facebook. I'm going to be on Facebook for makeup. I'm not coming on here for, um, for makeup. I'm going to just go on Facebook for it. And because um, I want to be able to, um, all my sisters don't know. Nobody doesn't know I'm here. Okay. So I did my YouTube. I'm going to do my Facebook and I'm going to do my Instagram and do it that way. So y'all see me when I come back on what y'all see me on Facebook.